I was in a group called the Pussycat Dolls. Anything between you and the girls? Like, um, you know, like... Sexually? Yes. You're so full of shit. No, I'm not. I, I want to <laughs> so know. We showered together and, you know, so you're you're showered naked. all the time. What was that? Oh, my. Could you imagine? Everybody knows how you get around, baby. I hate What's up, y'all? This is Melody Thornton, and you're checking out This Is 50.com. Yes, This Is 50.com. We're here live. They call me the Heineken, aka Mr. Scumbag. And right now, yeah, yeah. Don't worry. I'm going to take it easy with you. Okay. And we have Miss Melody Thornton yeah. sitting right next to my right. She came prepared. Your legs are showing beautiful. Wow. Thank you. Thank oh, you. Yeah. I've been traveling, so I'm just lucky I had a pair Sorry. of shorts. But for those who don't know, who might not be familiar with right. you, let them know who you are, though. I was in a group called the Pussycat Dolls. Don't you wish your girlfriend was a freak like me? So so. Say it again and slow, because you're saying it like it's just a random situation. Yeah, okay, well, I was in a the major recording group, the yeah. Pussycat Dolls. Mm -hmm. So, yeah. Multi-platinum? Well, yeah, you know, a little bit of that. A little bit of that. Yeah, a little mainstream. Mainstream. Mm-hmm. I was the black one. Yes. Oh, well, clearly. So, that's, that's, <laughs> that's, 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 when I first got on Twitter, that was my, my thing, and I thought about being, like, the black one from the Pussycat Dolls as my main name, but I was like, you know, I don't want to, I don't want to do but all that. when I look at you, I, I get more of an exotic feel. Do more, you? I don't get no black get on this from you, like, you from Compton or something. My mom is Mexican. Were well, you dad. from the West Coast? Yeah, yeah. I'm from Arizona. Oh, mm -hmm. land of the air conditioners. Yeah. The industry that ain't you up alive. All right, all right. And the little church in the wild. This on your blacklist. Well, what is the reason for that name? I like it. It's Thank arrogant, you. It's disrespectful. You need to make this impact. <laughs> but when you see the packaging and all that, it's it's nothing like that. And then you flip it over and it's like piss on your blacklist. Oh, host. so you're not doing a little Kim squat and no. pissing on somebody's lip. That would be incredible. Just make sure you're shaving them. Right. Oh, <laughs> well, you know, I I, I try to keep the trim, uh, the trunk trimmed. Oh, that's but not um, bad. no, no, no. Piss on your blacklist is is just a like you said it, an ignorant way of saying kind of like you know if you don't fit into the box or the mainstream, that's cool. You know, keep your list. I'm gonna do me and. I'll end up pissing on your list. Well, you felt that ever since you left the group, or you got parted ways, mm -hmm. it's been difficult for you or something like that? Um, it? Well, it's definitely been difficult. I took some time to figure out, well, I had to get back to like normal life. Just trying to get people familiar with my sound, and because it's not Pussycat Dolls. There's no auto-tune, it's all me, and that's, I'm, I'm gonna start there. It's like, um, I can Tina Turner, 1960s, Shirley Bassey, you know, BB yeah. King, think, the sound that I was raised on. How do you think the people are going to receive you as? Because you know, the main lead singer has always been Nicole, right. and it's always been the other girls. The music's good. It's not like, you know, I'm, I'm trying to create all this hype or doing all of these, you know, pulling stunts and things like yeah. that and being seen with so and so. And I was about to say, you need yeah. a reality show. They need a couple of rap. Yeah, yeah, yes, yes. Know. This is mainstream part of the media package, you know what I'm saying? Date a football player, no. date one of them, No. only for two weeks, you're good? Listen. Well, what made you leave the group? Because the way it seems in the media, it's like y'all just broke apart and Nicole decided to do her own thing and she left y'all. Right, but that's not even really, we, we did just break apart. All you right. know, contracts just ran out, it was like, all right, cool, you know, like we're good on y'all type of, not like that, not like it was like bad blood in any way, it just yeah. contracts ran out. But my relationship with all of the girls is really tight. Yeah, so no, it's, it's pretty tight. I haven't spoken to Nicole since June, but all of the other girls I pretty much talk to every day. <laughs> and Get Rich or Die Trying was the first rap album I ever bought. Yeah, as you should. And I know every song. But I'm like, so, you so, know, I'm like a poppy girl. So, so, so a couple of lyrics from me. I've been patiently waiting for a track to explode on. <laughs> I can't go that low. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah, just go. You can, can, can harmonize it. Tangeray and Alize, I don't need shit. I get high all the time. See, I gotta sing it. Yeah. I get high all the time. I can't do the ad libs in between. Melody Thornton reciting 50 sick lyrics. I, I sing many men like it's like, you know, like a many love song. Men. Yep. 
You see many men as a love song. Meaning, like you know, He's I talking get about almost dying. How well, I'm saying, happen? like you know, I've seen I've seen guys in the club cry to that song, like. Not in, not in the East Coast. <laughs> bottles and trying to holler. Man. You know what he's really good at is, is melodies. Yeah. And like always creating good, you know. That's the same, same as you ladies. You, you know? know? What's, what attracts the audience. Like, you remind me of Roxy for some strange reason. Really? Yeah, 106 in Park. Oh. Man, what, yeah. Is that a good thing? No, I mean, yeah, well, yeah. But, you know, she's cool. People love Roxy. Do, do oh, they yeah. not? Yeah, you know. I try to give her a foot massage back in the day. How did that go over? Well, Mano came in and he started rubbing up her feet. I, yeah, I don't lie about these things. Okay. Yeah, I'll tell you one thing. When you decide to get in a relationship, okay. this is very important. The moment you start posting up pictures of your boyfriend, I'm going to flag you for nudity. I don't play that <laughs> shit, all right? I come to see you bend over, singing, whatever. That's so it. you won't like the new project then? <laughs> Uh, it's on your blacklist. It's yes. out right now. Where can the fans and the supporters get it? You can download it at uh, MelodyThornton.com. It's out now. Mm -hmm. P-O-Y-B-L. Please support independent artists. Please, please, please. You're saying independent. Yeah, you good money. Hey, listen. I'm an independent artist. Make sure you get it. I'm here to remind you what you do in the dark comes to light And just so you know Cause you try to bury me Doesn't mean you will shine